It's the kind of beat to go Hey guys, what's up? It's Joey and you know just to break up this little mini series we got going on right now I'm here to bring you the troop showcase for the commando now this troop is awesome. I love it It's a great 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 melee range short ranged fire power expert Swaggy units. I love it. It's really cool. That was not the best description I ever given in my life But it was a pretty solid one, I must say but let's just get right into this description right here The commandos are highly trained combat machines her deluge of bullets shames weak enemies Fires very fast but weak shots can hold off the horde with little help has trouble with highly high health or armored targets so I must say the commando does a phenomenal job against drones, against runners, against spitters, against those lower health units. It just does an amazing, amazing job. I've got to say it's, I love it. It's one of my favorite units to just put up there. Kind of a great combo with the, um, say you put in some sharpshooters, say you put in some machine gunners. I don't know, anything. It really will go well with anything, guys. If you just need some help, sort of close range, hold down those drones. This is probably one of the best units you can throw in there. Now, it's really good if you want to put it right paired with a machine gunner. It could actually be very good because that machine gunner can take some time to load up. And if you put that commando with that, it'll be able to hold out that horde just long enough, let the machine gunner get warmed up, and bang, you're off to the races. And it's pretty much game over, I've got to say. So, I've got it's just one of my favorite units. I just wanted to really do a little video with this, guys. I hope you will enjoy it because... If you, I believe that you can pick up this commando either in the packs randomly, and I'm pretty sure that you will be getting one along the, the way in the campaign. Now, as you can see, I do have two level ones just sitting around, so I'm probably going to work on upgrading this commando, start getting up her to level 30, and that'd be actually very nice to get a new perk there, I must say. That'd be nice to get. But let's go ahead and go through these perks really quick. First one is 5% chance, chance to deal 200% damage. Remove, aim, drift. So that's pretty nice, I guess. Pretty swaggy. That I did not able to. I was not able to choose. It pretty much less recoil stuff like that. It's gonna be really nice. And I was not able to pick that perk just because it was given to me. Now the other one here we have length and barrel. So it increases the range by 25%. Now I personally probably would have picked that one, but I didn't get the chance to pick. So kind of stuck with it. Got an extra unit right here. Deployment size increased by one. Next one, armor piercing ignores target armor. So say you have a titan say you have a dreadnought it's gonna ignore that armor and it's pretty much game over here so here we have another one covert ops gains stealth so they're gonna get a little sneaky gonna get a little stealthy gonna be a little bit hidden pretty sweet little perk right there i may uh, i don't know which one i go for haven't gotten there yet but you'll know when i get there eventually and increased deployment size again i always love that one who doesn't love an extra unit of their favorite type and right here fight and flights so they shoot while retreating so if those guys are getting a little too close they're going to move on back but keep on firing it's very nifty i like that perk a lot next one evasion dodges 20 percent of incoming attacks so those zombies are swiping the commando's got a chance at dodging it so that's a pretty nifty perk there too haven't gotten the chance to pick one yet i'm not really sure which one i pick of these because these are very key influential perks to pick and I'm just not sure which one I go with. But when we get there, we'll definitely find out, won't we? So let's go ahead and fight here. Let's go ahead and check out. We were on Rio for the last troop showcase. Let's go check out Nairobi here. How much team power do we have? Let me see real quick. We have, oh, 1,910. We're going to go on a little bit lower map here then. Not too much. We're going to go on hard for Mexico City. Let's go ahead and fight. What can I borrow? I'm going to borrow Commando because this is a Commando troop showcase. Let me consume some units really quick so we can attack. I'm going to take out, hmm, I don't need all these firefighters. Let's go ahead and disband them, get some extra crates here. Eh, one more for safe measure. We have six open slots there. Let's go ahead and fight on hard fight, and we're going to borrow that commando. And let me upgrade this, update this team a little bit. I'm going to swap out this spec ops for machine gunner. I'm going to show you that little pairing I was talking about. So we're going to throw in that machine gunner, that MG. Actually, you know what, let's throw in the buzz shot to a little bit lower level. I don't want the... These guys should pretty much just take the cake. They will pretty much dominate anything. I don't know what it is, but they're just very good units. So, here we go. What do we have here? This is a very close quarter. We have some delivery men. That's going to be not so fun. Got to admit, I don't like them. They bother me. But, we can do this. I'm feeling confident. So, 
right here, this is what I'm going to be talking about. We're going to throw down the buzzsaw right up front here, and we're going to put three of these commandos pretty close. Now, what these guys are going to be able to do, they're going to be able to take out any of those drones, delivery men that try to get close. It's going to give that buzzsaw a little bit extra distance and a little bit more time to just get warmed up and then he can just go to work and it's a perfect straight away so i'm really looking forward to see how that works out now over here i'm going to put one of these pretty much higher level commandos over here paired with a mercenary and then two lower level commandos now these guys are going to have a little good crossfire thing going we're going to let that deliverman take out that first wall go ahead and do that and then they're going to be having to run into this little brick wall we have here now, over here, a little bit different kind of challenge. I'm going to be throwing in my two dead shots here. Hopefully, we're going to get a good sh little look at the delivery men here. And we're going to throw in one commando over here, one over there. We're just going to fill in the rest of these gaps with commandos. Bang, bang. Let's move these guys up just a little bit closer here. Let's start these waves. So, I'm going to focus on over here for the beginning here. Just kind of show you guys these commandos aren't even doing anything. There we go. So they're going to be able to hold off those. Oh, that wasn't even anything. But they are able to hold off those drones and pretty much just let that buzzsaw get to work. See, and they have a little bit of extra space in between them. It's a really nice little comp. They complement each other very nicely. So let's go ahead and send this out. So that delivery man's coming right out of the gates. Those commandos are able to take him out. They're not taking too much damage. Given that time, the buzzsaw is able to warm up perfectly, take out these just a few drones, not even anything. But as you can see, they're able to take out anything that gets a little bit close and gives that buzzsaw plenty of range here as you can see now there's not too many drones coming out i don't know what's up with that there's like nobody coming out that was a weird attack thing right there but that's pretty much the commandos right there it's nothing too crazy you guys see me use these commandos plenty of times before this so i'm sure you get the basic gist of what the commando entails but guys thank you so much for watching i hope you did enjoy this video and i will see you guys in the next video see you guys later